Hey everybody, this is PJ Riley from Lancaster Archery here at the 2020 ATA show. I am in the Easton booth with Clint Warner and Clint, bow cases are important to us, they're important to you. Tournament archers need something good and Easton has come out with some significant upgrades. Tell us about this great new case. Yeah, so we've been in the tournament bow case business for probably seven years and we've, you know, we've got a lot of respect for our cases, a good reputation. And even with the good cases we've been making, um, you know, those, you know, we got Rio and Steve and those guys are going to, they wear out cases. Yeah. They do. And so what we wanted to do was make a case that's more durable, lasts longer than anything that we've ever done before. Sure. So uh, what we've got here, this new case line, we're going to call the bow truck. Bow truck. Love so it. it's built like a truck, literally. <laughs> so, you know, it, there's, without getting too crazy on you. I'll just tell you the, the highlights. We're using a Cordura ballistic nylon fabric in this case. Now, there are three types of fabrics. There's polyester, there's regular nylon, and there's Cordura ballistic nylon. Now, regular ballistic nylon is not Cordura. Okay, Cordura is different. Um, it has three times the abrasion resistance and puncture resistance as regular nylons and polyesters. It has a much, much higher durability. It was actually designed for body armor for the military. It's also used today in airbags for cars. Okay, so it is a very expensive material. That's why you don't see it used in a lot of things. When we designed this case, I went to our factory and our designer and I said, I want the best of the best. I don't care what it costs. <laughs> Pretty simple. Most cases on the market are being built to cost targets and designers are forced to use lower quality materials to hit cost targets. That wasn't what we did here. Okay, so this is this represents the best materials I could possibly buy. So I'm really proud of that. And so um, the, most of the, a lot of the Eastern travel cases, you're used to having an airline cover. Now you don't need that. This comes just like it is. Yeah, that's correct. So travel covers are always a good idea, right? But what we were finding is they weigh three pounds and weight was always a problem so people just weren't using them and then they're wearing the case out so really that created a need that we needed to address by let if people aren't using a cover then we need to build the case better so that it's gonna work better without a cover and that's exactly what it is so this does not have a cover available for it um, but we feel that it's gonna it's still gonna travel well and, and do well better than we've done and so the material itself is going to help it hold up, yeah. but that's not all you did. You yeah. also have a new zipper that's on here. Tell us about that. Exactly. So we're unique with our cases, and, and from what, I, as far as I know, we're still the only company that used YKK zippers in, in cases. They were the best zippers on the market. They still are. YKK um, has innovated a new zipper technology called a woven-in zipper. Now, normal zippers use stitching to attach the zipper coil to the zipper tape behind it. If that stitching breaks, the zipper can unravel and fail. YKK invented this technology so that the coil of the zipper is woven into the fabric of the zipper tape without any stitching. And what that allows that zipper to do is even if you were to have abrasion on that portion of the zipper, it's not gonna cause a situation that's gonna create a failure of that zipper. That's a big deal. It's a huge deal. So YKK invented that. It's only been out a year. Um, and we've used it in this case. So we've got, and as we were talking, you have new handles on here to make this thing nicer yeah. uh, to work with. You've got bigger wheels on the bottom uh, to make it easier to pull and to roll. Yeah. Um, and we should mention here that the size of the case is gonna fit any tournament bow. Tell us about the specs from that pr perspective. Sure, um, previously we've sold cases in, an, in a 47 and a 44 inch length. Uh, by far, the 47-inch length is what people want, so we, we didn't want to mess that up. So we, we, this case is available in a single 47-inch length model. It's going to accommodate any modern target compound bow on the market. Um, you could also use it as a hunting travel case. It, it holds a lot of gear, so you know it's, it's an awesome option for that as well. But just to touch on the handles a little bit, so we, we, once we nailed the, the durability and the performance characteristics of the case, we said, look, we've got seven years of experience in this. What can we do to improve the user experience? 
So we tried to make it more ergonomic, just more clean, you know, in, in a lot of design refinements. So you'll notice that the handles, we went away from the, uh, like a nylon webbing style handle to more of a grab handle like this. Yep. It's very soft and comfortable. When you pull it, you'll find it doesn't cause, you know, any pain in your hand or anything like that. Same thing on this side. And also, a lot of shooters, I mean, we're, we're trying to serve an international customer base. Yes. A lot of shooters um, are smaller stature. A lot of shooters are larger. And on a larger case like this, it's hard for a small shooter to m handle and manipulate and transport a big case. So we strategically put a lot of handles in different areas so that any shooter of any size can deal with their case. So we've got handles on the front, a handle on the bottom. They're spaced at a distance that anyone can deal with. Um, handle on the end, and then again the one on the side. So it's easy to, to maneuver. And then on the front here, this is my favorite part. <laughs> we've got a trailer hitch strap system. So when you're trying to carry this through a train station or an airport and you have other bags and you only have two hands, it becomes a challenge. So with this trailer hitch strap system, you can take another bag, and it doesn't even have to be a, a rolling bow case. You can attach a suitcase, you know, a rolling duffel, anything to it with the strap. And now I can take and walk around with just one hand and tow, you know, tow two cases around. So the trailer hitch strap is a great little feature uh, just to make life easier when you're trying to get on your flight on time. Sure. Um, Clint, let's open it up and let people see what it looks like inside there. Absolutely. Okay, so if you're familiar with our cases, um, not a lot needed to be improved on our previous version, but we did make some refinements. The first thing I'll, I'll point out is the arrow pocket we made larger. So what, what we find is that stabilizers need a home. Yep. And in the previous version, um, this was great for an arrow tote, but we wanted to allow for stabilizers to have a, a good place to be. So we've, a lot of, I would say, you've got your arrow tube, you can put a, another arrow tube next to it to put stabilizers in. We still have accommodation for two bows in the case. Um, our seatbelt strap system, um, we've reinforced to a stronger webbing. And then we have a removable divider that comes, that comes in the case as well. So this is an optional thing. I just, I would suggest using it. It just provides more protection, but we made some refinements to that. Um, one more really cool thing about the case that's nice, there's a lot of times where you get to where you're going, you get unpacked, you get your case put away, and then you remember, oh, I, there's something I need, right? So we just have a nice little convenience feature here in this outer pocket. You can open it up, and we have an access from the, to the inside from the outside via the outer pocket. So, Without having to ho open the whole case up. Exactly. Especially when, you've got, when you're on a, a shooting line, you've got a lot of cases lined up behind the tables and stuff. It's just a convenient way to quickly get in and out of, of your case. So that's just another added feature that we've put into this um, as well. Um, and so, Clint, uh, as you were saying, you went for the highest end materials to go on here. And as you said, uh, you told them, I don't care what it costs. As far as bow cases go, especially tournament grade bow cases, this thing is not ridiculously priced, however. It's really not. I'm proud that it is the best of the best case. I'm proud to say it is the best roller case on the market, and it's not just hype. Um, we're, we're at 419 MSRP on it, which isn't really much higher than where we were with our previous model. And I think that people are really going to appreciate the real tangible benefits that it's going to bring in, in durability and longevity. Gotcha. That is an incredible new case from Easton here just being unveiled at the 2020 ATA show. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Want to see more videos like it, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to click that bell to get notifications whenever we put out new videos. And as always, if you have any questions, you can visit us at LancasterArchery.com. <laughs> <laughs>